Okay, we have the uh, Innovative and Evolution uh, H-Series alternator brackets. This is the Innovative 59185. This is the Evolution uh, Evolution 27408 a bracket. Um, either one of these will work with uh, basically any H-Series swap, whether it's... Uh, you know, H to B, uh, a swap Civic, Integra, a Corn, or, um, you know, if you're just doing a straight replacement, a Prelude. Either one of these guys is going to replace your uh, AC bracket, the original one, so you are deleting your AC, which is something that a lot of people don't know. I think they think that this will just directly replace their original uh, alternator bracket, but this does relocate it. Uh, down where your air conditioning uh, bracket used to be. Uh, both will, both are the same. Both will, will do that. Uh, the um, first thing you'll notice is this guy is really heavy. I don't know that that necessarily makes it stronger, but it it is really thick uh, steel that they make this out of, and it's very heavy. Uh, innovative one is reinforced. It's quite a bit lighter. They are now reinforced. Uh, since they've done that, I really haven't seen anybody with complaints, uh, you know, of, of any sort of breakage or anything like that. Um, so they're both very reliable. Um, the uh, Evolution one, you'll notice, does have a swing arm, whereas the Innovative one is fixed. This will give you a little extra adjustability, as well as uh, the fact that it it allows you to use either a D-series alternator or an H-series alternator. Uh, so you can use that single cam alternator if you're coming from a swap. That's probably going to be your original alternator. Uh, that's what these spacers are there for to help you out with that. The innovative one actually has a uh, double bolt pattern here. And this is to... Uh, to help you out with a half inch offset. So if you are eliminating your bound shaft and depending on the kit you're using um, or if you just want to uh, you know, push it, push this guy in a half inch um, with that bound shaft removed, this has both bolt patterns on it. So it makes that nice and easy to do. Uh, people don't use that half inch offset as much as they used to now that Say, uh, you know, the KS Tune kit actually comes with a spacer, so a lot of times you're not using that half inch offset. But if you need it, you're going to want to go with the innovative bracket. Um, likewise, if you're if you need the maximum space and you want to use a D series alternator, which is a little bit smaller, you're probably going to want to go with the evolution bracket. Um, both are pretty good brackets, we sell. Probably the innovative three to one, uh, largely due to the price, I guess. Uh, and the name brand innovative is a little more well known. Uh, and the innovative one is just over eighty bucks. The evolution one is about, I think, one twenty nine, so around one hundred and thirty bucks. Um, that's the evolution uh, alternator relocation bracket and the innovative bracket. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, just uh, let us know.